Three members of what the FBI calls a lotto scam were arraigned today. They allegedly targeted Latino seniors, and there may be more suspects out there. CBS NLA's Tina Patel has the details. The FBI thinks there could be other victims out there and other criminals trying this scam. That's why they held a press conference trying to raise awareness. Take a look at three people who are arraigned in federal court today. 38-year-old Luisa Camargo, 68-year-old Mercedes Montanez, 49-year-old Tito Lozado, all Colombian nationals who live in the Los Angeles area. The three were targeting elderly Hispanic women who were by themselves either walking or shopping in the middle of the day. One of the defendants would approach the victim, say they had a winning lottery ticket and needed help cashing it, sometimes saying they couldn't do so because of immigration issues. They would call one of the other defendants who would pose as a lottery official and say there was a fee that needed to be paid in order to cash that winning ticket. At least 11 victims fell for the scam, losing thousands in cash and jewelry. Here's what the FBI wants everyone to know. No one should ever, under any circumstance, give money in order to receive money. That is the hallmark of many schemes about which the FBI is currently receiving complaints. The people arrested have been tied to cases from 2017 on in cities like Chula Vista, Long Beach and Fontana. The victims all in their 60s, 70s and 80s said they felt confused and intimidated. That's why the FBI wants to know if anyone else out there thinks they may have been a victim.